Hello everyone, this is Lori Lytle with Mortgage Coach Support. In today's video tutorial, I'll show you how the consumer will be able to download the app for Edge. So with this TCA product, um, let me go into my reflector. Once you have emailed the link to the consumer, they will go ahead and click on it on their iPad. It will come up to a web browser and if they don't have the app already downloaded, it will say it cannot open the page. And what they'll have to do is go to the App Store and get the Mortgage Coach app. So if they press that blue button, it will direct them um, to our app and then they're going to go ahead and install it. So I went ahead and clicked on the button. Okay. And it's going to go ahead and start that process um, of installing the app here. So I also want to let you know if um, you do send them a revised TCA or a, a one of the reports, they won't have to reinstall this um, app. It will already be on their iPad and they'll just be able to go ahead and click on the link and it will open up. So this is the home page of the app. What I'm going to do is go back to my email real quick and let's go ahead and click on that link. So it'll bring them directly to Edge and it'll bring up the report. So we have the disclaimer here. I'm going to press I understand. You'll see how we have the video in the upper right hand corner. It just started playing as soon as they came into this uh, into the report. And then you'll have all your contact information um, right in the center here. But how the consumer is going to be able to use this app is they'll go ahead and click on Summary. And it will go ahead and provide that information that is in the upper right hand corner of the report. So you'll see the Buy Now column right here and you'll see all that information displayed here. If you click on the More Info button right here on the report, all these buttons here, the Payment uh, Breakdown, your Closing Cost, and the Reinvestment is located down here on the app. So you could go ahead and click on that or click on the closing cost as well in the reinvestment screen. There's also the second page for the reinvestment screen. So I'm going to go ahead in the upper left hand corner here is a back button. That will actually take you back to the main um, page of your report. So you have that. So let me go ahead and let's show you what the monthly payment savings looks like. So if I go ahead and click on that, you'll see your graph. Let me go ahead and close out of the web-based report. And you'll see how the graph is mimicking the report that just like on the web. If you slide to the right, they'll go ahead and see that monthly payment breakdown, which is the same information behind that more info button right here. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the left hand corner of the screen. So we'll go back and then they would go ahead and click on short term savings. Again, you have the graph and they swipe to the right and they'll have their information that is behind the more info. And then lastly, we have our principal paid long term, the lower right hand corner of our graph. So right here, again it has the <gasps> graphs as well as the data that's behind the more info button right here. So that's primarily how they would go ahead and use it. This app also works with the live feature so if you end up making any kind of changes, you're on the phone, they have their iPad open, those changes will display for them, the report will be driven just like it is on the web page. So go ahead and try that out. Um, if you have an iPad, try it out for yourself. See how that process works. But it works the same. And if you have any questions at all, you can go ahead and email us at support at mortgagecoach.com. Thank you. Enjoy your day.